jockeying with Sousa Jr. Ground ball short stop. Bogarts to second one first. Just got him over there on the 6 4 3 double play. I'll tell you, Porcello did get the ground ball, and Bogarts, I thought that the flip to Pedroia took a little bit too long to get there, and that was going to give Echeverria a chance to beat it out. And that's what the Rays are looking at right here. Ball gets in, cracks the bat. This is a long underhand flip. Tried to get it there as quick as he could. I thought maybe that gave Echeverria a chance. And I think the Rays are going to take a look at that. Oh, uh, yeah, I think he got there. I think he absolutely got there. Chris Conroy on the call, and so the Rays will challenge the call at first base. Looking for that ball into the interior of the glove, and when you saw the glove from Mitch Moreland move, the foot of Echeverria was there. This is this shouldn't take very long. He's going to be safe. He also, you know, he went to the front edge of the bag. Didn't go into the middle of the bag. Watch him right to the front edge. You're not going to be able to see it clear here. That foot is down before that ball goes in. That other angle from the first base camera showed it the best. There's another good look at it. The foot is there. But now you can't see the glove. But if you get that first base low first look, you can see the glove move, and Echeverria's foot is already on the bag. Watch Moreland reaching. There's the catch. Then the ball goes into the glove. So this should be overturned. Jerry Beals, the crew chief, along with Conroy, waiting for a ruling from New York. We saw the Rays. We'll get that base runner at first. It's a fielder's choice. 